because I need to get my shit together because I've just been wasting away for two days now uh, well four days if you count the weekend and I've just been doing nothing but uh, binging Modern Family and it, that show is addictive but I need to like I need to stop because it's, it's getting out of hand especially because I'm working from home I'm not I don't have any obligation to just stop and do something else I have a lot of work to do with regards to my shop because we are dropping like new products uh, for Pride Month and then I have to film some videos which should go up this week and I just have a lot of plans okay let me show you I don't know if you can see but I my day is packed and so is like so is all the other days it's not a lot but it takes time so I'm, I'm already behind because like I, I already was supposed to start uh, the social media stuff for paper shades but I didn't <laughs> so I need to do that and I also have to film a video today and I have to post a TikTok and on Instagram so those are the things that I have to do and I just haven't been doing any of them it's easy to like just lose yourself in like a TV show or whatever because there's nobody because there is no one to guide you or tell you what to do when you're working for yourself, right? So, oh, I don't think I've mentioned this in my vlog. Everybody in my life knows, so I, I don't think I mentioned it here, but I did quit my job uh, like a few months ago and I've been home. I've been trying to find a place that I really want to work. I just don't want to go for like any job that I'm gonna get because in terms of like, because my job will be creating content as well. So I don't, I just don't want to join somewhere that I'm gonna half ass everything and it's it's a it's a pain to them, it's a pain to me so I've just been getting a lot of offers and interviews, they're just not what I want and I'm at a place in my life where I can have to take a step back and be picky with where I work and what job I want to take so I'm not worried about that, I'm still looking for like the right job but until then I'm, like I said, I've started uh, my shop again and we've been doing it really well and it's been going really well and I'm really happy with the products that we're putting out. I'll leave a link down below uh, if you guys want to check it out. But you have to live in Sri Lanka if you want to place any orders because we're not doing anything internationally right now. But I do have a Redbubble account which again is something I'm supposed to be doing but I haven't done it. I need to update that. I'll also leave that um, in the link down below if you want to check it out. That is international. So anyway, yeah, that is the thing and in terms of reading, I'm 
Oh, in terms of reading, I got a book that I can include that clip here and then we'll come back to what I'm reading. Okay, coming at you with a package. I don't know exactly what this is. And I think I mentioned in my other vlog as well that I read the first book and I just wanted to unbox this in the vlog because I just... Oh my god, I was like, look at it. I've honestly never... I've been waiting for this. Okay, okay. Let's do it. Look at this gloss. I'm in love. So floppy. <sighs> yes. Am I gonna read it right now? <sighs> oh, yes. I just got lost in the lost in something on page 8 <laughs> but whoa I'm not usually a fan of this but on this it works oh man so pretty oh wait that's it right as you saw I got Hero of the Night and it arrived right on time and so I'm gonna be reading this uh, for this vlog and I wanna see how it goes. I already started. Yeah, I I read the prologue and uh, this other thing called the paradox. No idea what that is. Um, I'm confused. I don't know what's going on, but I'm in, I'm in it. I want to know more. And then of course I'm reading City of Brass. This is the this is for the read along which I mentioned in my previous video as well and I've been tabbing so that we can discuss everything uh, on the live show which is uh, gonna be at the end of the month on this channel uh, so again okay, it's great I, I need to get back to everything because I like my routine I've been having like a very good routine for like a few months now and I've been enjoying it just <laughs> I just need to stop binging TV shows because it's just gonna mess with the entire thing anyway so right now I'm gonna go do some stuff for my shop and then I will update you in a bit maybe during lunch I would say this is this is not just a reading vlog this is a live slash reading vlog so it's gonna be a bit of both couple hours later now I did some work and then I got to got to about three chapters into Sea of Brass. It's just as good. I can't stop having I can't stop smiling. Just being back in that world. I feel like if this book if this series had more than three books and I don't know fifteen books I would read all the oh my god the letting is terrible I need to figure out a different angle. But anyway, before that, I wanted to show you my lunch because I ordered from this place called Kama Cantima. It's somewhere in Kote. It's so good. And they're not always open all the time, right? And also, they only have three dishes, I think. It's prawn, chicken, and vegetable, yellow rice. And it is incredible. I hope you try it out because and it's, it's very cheap like compared to a lot of the other places. This is about how much is it? I think it's like 500 bucks for yellow rice, 
um, all the other places that I checked out about 700 800 so it is cheaper it's so good it's not like I said it's not always open all the time it's also it also gives you like egg and chicken not just the chicken so I mean yeah I'm just gonna I'm gonna dive right into it watch some modern family and maybe film a TikTok after um, and continue with the city of rest. It is the end of the day, it's around 8.40, I just had dinner, I cleaned the kitchen, I didn't really get a chance to talk uh, since the morning update, <laughs> but I did do a few things, you saw me, I had my lunch, 
and I read for a bit um, then I took a nap which was very involuntary but I took it <laughs> uh, I guess my body needs it I don't know but also I did this I did one thing today which is very uh, I wanted to mention see we have a gym at this complex that I'm living in right so it's right downstairs you don't even have to take the stairs we have a lift so I <laughs> so I was thinking like I used to work out I used to love working out and I did that for like even you know, last year um, I was doing it with my friend and then we kind of we both kind of stopped doing it because we got so busy with work so I now that I'm home I really want to get back into it and start and there's a gym literally beneath me and I figured like I might as well just make the most of it and start to go which I haven't done done yet I may be I guess I'll show you if you guys are interested in it. Uh, what I wanted to tell you is that I'm such an introvert that I actually went... So while I was taking out the trash, I went downstairs and checked the gym to see if there were any people. Just kind of, you know, did like a recon to make sure that there's nobody there. And I'm planning to go now and also check it out to see if there's anybody there so that I know which, which like what time I should go. Because I like to go in the morning because I feel like that's the best time for me to go or maybe even uh, towards like the middle of the day when I'm feeling uh, very n nappy <laughs> so anyway that's so I wanted to make sure that there's nobody there we don't have a lot of people living here so of course like there's not gonna be a lot of people in that gym but I just don't want anybody there when I'm working out because I'm just it's so weird because <laughs> I've I'm somebody who used to go to the gym like with so many people around and I never really never really bothered me but I guess I guess, what I, now that I think about it, I guess it's because I have a choice here as opposed to a gym when it's like a public space and you don't really have a choice but you have to uh, be around people. So I guess that maybe that's why my mind is like, you know, you have the choice to go when nobody's going. So you should take advantage of it. I think that's why. <laughs> but anyway, that's, that's what I did. In terms of reading, I got to about... I got way past the chapters that we were supposed to read for the week but I, I can't stop I'm just I'm flying through it and I kind of need more tabs so I'm, I'm pausing for now till I get more tabs because otherwise I'm definitely gonna forget like I'm literally I'm almost like I also I filmed like a TikTok and I put some something up on Instagram so I did all of that and the only thing I couldn't do is the filming part of it uh, I wanted to film a video which I'll probably do tomorrow have the time and I'll probably go to the gym tomorrow which is just exciting <laughs> anyway that is it this is the video I hope you enjoyed this is a very random one that I filmed because I just needed to get things done and get on a routine and I know it's just one day so who knows what will happen tomorrow but at least I ticked off the things that I want to do except for the video which again is not due this week so it's fine so i'm glad i'm really happy with that hope you enjoyed this video and if you like it give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more of this content and i really hope you're here for the long run i do upload every sunday and the occasional video on tuesday so watch out for that and i hope you have a great day wherever you are and i will see you soon with a new video bye bye